Hi there, my name is Noelle. I'm one of the nurse managers here for the Reproductive Medicine Group. I understand that your doctor has told you it is time to take your trigger shot to get ready for your IUI. That is awesome news. We're really excited that you've made it this far. The good news beyond that is that this injection to create ovulation is quite easy. There's not a lot to know. There's not many pieces or parts, but let's talk about it. First thing I want you to do is go ahead and if you have not picked up your Ovidrill from the pharmacy in which it was called or if this was not sent to you via overnight, I need you to call the Reproductive Medicine Group so that we can make sure that you have your injection and that you're ready at the appropriate timing. This particular injection is very time specific, so your nurse should have given you a time um, that you will need to follow that will correspond with your IUI. So the Ovidrill is a pre-filled syringe one dose is in one box. It's quite simple to use. I also want you to make sure that you have nice clean hands. The best way to do this at home is to use warm soap and water. And I want you to make sure that you're cleaning under your fingertips, uh, fingernails, in the creases of your hands and whatnot. Today I'm using rubbing alcohol, which in a pinch can work for you. Just make sure that you're rubbing for at least 10 seconds, letting your hands air dry. The next thing I want you to get out is your alcohol swab so that you can prepare the skin. This is going to be a subcutaneous injection. We're using the fat in your belly. It's the only time in your life you enjoy having a muffin top. So Merry Christmas. That's our gift to you. And um, then the next thing is to just take the shot out of the box. It's going to look like this in kind of a clear package sealed um, vial or syringe rather. I want you to go ahead and open that. And so you'll see in your syringe, there is an air bubble there. That is by design. I do not want you to worry about getting the air bubble out. The air bubble will actually help you to push the medicine into your skin further. So everything is perfect the way that it is here. Let's clean our skin. So what you're gonna do is find that muffin top. We like you to be at least one inch away from the belly. And to do that, find your belly button. Um, I want you to just find somewhere on this belly shot. Um, you're gonna pinch your skin, making a nice big kind of hill for you to inject in. Take your alcohol swab, clean it for at least 10 seconds. The friction is actually what kills any bacteria that lives on our skin, not the actual alcohol. So it is important that you're rubbing here, okay? Let that air dry. Please do not waft or wave or blow on this. Um, so let that air dry. What I want you to do next is pull off the gray cap from your Ovidrill. Remember I said, please don't remove the air bubble. We're going to take our Ovidrill syringe. We're gonna go 90 degree angle, straight into our belly, and we're gonna push, push, push all of the liquid and the air into our skin. Then when that plunger is completely flush with the end of the syringe, you'll pull out your needle. You'll find your local, your, your sharps box here drop your syringe into the sharps box and you're done.